Hello and welcome back to Rollercoaster Tycoon again. Where uh, last time we scored a point against the devs in the uh, outdoing them competition. Really, I mean uh, those three steel coasters that we built. I think uh, they were pretty close up there, despite the red track being a little bit off sync uh, at the end of the ride. I think um, we. Well, at least met them, uh, you know, in coaster performance. And uh, especially if we just take a look at the ratings only, uh, we were up there along with them. So, however, along with them and uh, equal to is not outdoing them. So, I haven't kept my promise yet. But uh, fortunately, we got plenty of parks to uh, still prove ourselves that we are better. Better than the devs. Fact. <laughs> Look at this, we got more than enough bikes to prove ourselves. <laughs> In fact, <laughs> we got a bajillion. Oh man. <laughs> Look at this freaking long list. <laughs> we only completed six. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> um, anyway, uh, Haunted Harbor is uh, history. Uh, let's go to the next fun fortress. So, and of course, let's pause it. Now, this castle. Hey, a castle, huh? It's all yours to turn into a theme park. And we need to get 1300 guests at the end of October, year 3, with an uh, abysmal rating. <laughs> which isn't gonna be a challenge at all. I mean, honestly, those ratings of 600, I mean, you don't need to do anything for that at all. I usually end up with 999 anyway. Nino, Nino, Nino. Um, alright, so we got ourselves a castle. Let's check it out, alright? Wow. And we got a wall. <gasps> and look at this. Wow. We got the freaking castle. So they weren't lying at all. Towers, cantilevers, everything, man. <gasps> That's pretty. Look at those details. All right. That's pretty. Oh, man. Oh, man. We, we can do so many freaking awesome stuff with this. <sighs> wow. Oh man, I really, really like it. I can see coasters and uh, tracks and rides and stuff going around here everywhere. In fact, it looks a bit like uh, the Castle of Terror Hand. <laughs> Only this is finished and it's not one con big construction site <laughs> with half finished buildings. But, um, damn, man, this is cool. However, I also immediately spot a small tiny drawback. And, uh, yeah, this looks to be tarmac. See, this is kind of, it's cool that we got a castle, but it's also bad that there's paths everywhere. Because this is just a guest trap, really. I mean, they get lost, start whining, and uh, leave the park. So, once we start, the first thing we need to do is remove a crap load of path over here. It's not bad, really, because we will get a lot of money from it. Uh, speaking about money, we got 10 grants. Oh, uh, we can take another 15 if we need it. And we got, you know, a lot of money in this um, tarmac real estate and mud real estate. By the way, I don't really like the fact that there's mud in a freaking castle. <laughs> I mean, castles, they're meant for lords and kings and stuff. And not, you know, <laughs> slam filled up with mud and <laughs> dirt and crap and such. But yeah, man, and this wall as well, it's pretty neat. I mean, I can imagine myself building lots of cool things with this castle. Speaking about things to build... So let's check this out. Now, I am not. Uh, uh, no, <laughs> just no, <laughs> no. Not gonna look at it. It's not my section. Um, over here, oh, that's pretty decent, pretty neat. I mean, this castle, man. Oh man. Yeah, that's gonna be really, really cool. Um, so we got quite a few coasters as well, and also quite a few cheap ones. So. Got and this as well. So we're pretty well covered actually in the coaster department, so that's good. And over here it's rather bad. And ooh, nice, nice, nice. Because I just saw that we had a body of water over here, and um, it has rowing attraction written all over it. 
it has. You can't see it, but it's there. Um, and over here, uh, right? Yep, all the essentials are there. I see a drink stall, a food thing, and um, yeah, it's all there. Good stuff. So, how are I mean our researchers? Uh, you know, we need to put them to the right work, or actually, <laughs> the medicine man, or whatever the uh, doctors at this age were called. Yeah, man, we're gonna do medieval theming over here, but damn, look at this castle, man, and all the detail and stuff they put in it. I mean, for Rollercoaster Tycoon and stuff, with all the terraforming, this is done really, really well. I'm actually a bit jealous. Oh well. Ah uh, well, anyway, um, so we're covered in this. I do want more thrill rides. We had plenty of those. I don't want shops and stalls. I don't care about all the others. So, And I don't want gentle rides either. So we're going to go for thrill rides at first. But I mean, seeing as we have like mine-themed barrels and Egyptian um, monoliths or whatever, needle statue things. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah. Well, we don't have the Egyptian theming things, but we do got the mine theming, so... Alright, that's cool. Oh, in fact... <laughs> yeah, we're gonna make a true medieval theming out of this. Hell yeah. Good, good, good. So, um, first thing we need to do is um, open up the park. <laughs> in fact, uh, should I do that? I mean, I'm not really sure. Maybe I should wait just a little bit. And um, do the infrastructure first. I don't know. I don't know really whether or not it's worth it. Mm. Now we'll open it up. <laughs> we'll just have the guests wander around and enjoy the castle. <laughs> but um, yeah, this castle is pretty freaking awesome, man. Um, the only thing is, though, I mean, in terms of park expansion, before we and parts the game. Let's do a bit of park planning, right? I mean, obviously, we're gonna build lots of awesome cool saws here, but um, over here, I think what I'll do is I'll put like most of the thrill and gentle stuff around the castle, more or less, you know, over on this side. And what I want, I mean, I'm just gonna spoil my plan already over here. I mean, this wall over here is so freaking awesome. What I want is, like, a pair of coasters, you know? Just following the wall, preferably wooden coasters that go up and down quite a lot. And, um, I think I actually also did that uh, in the Evergreen Gardens Park, but not really sure. Uh, I think I made a coast as well that w followed the contours of the park, you know, and uh, that's pretty cool. We're gonna do that over here too, and uh, damn, a lot of coasters over here, and stuff, and things that are awesome. So, um, I also think it would be quite neat if we make, like, um, a square, <laughs> which is by now our patented infrastructure design, and layout uh, that goes like this more or less and then over there that is after we remove all the unnecessary path so we will do that first alright three two one unpause good and immediately I'm gonna seal off Oh, <laughs> that was the gate <laughs> alright maybe we should leave the gate in there uh, <laughs> that's bad <laughs> But um, let's rotate the view a bit. Yeah, and that can be gone. Oh man, there's actually quite a lot more path in there. Alright, I didn't know that. That's pretty bad actually. Um, Alright, so far. Yeah, I think it's actually better if we just remove everything. You know, including the gate. <laughs> Nobody can enter our castle. <laughs> We're walled in. Oh man, this reminds me of Nomoria. <laughs> Maybe I should rename this castle uh, to Terror Hand. <laughs> no, I'm not gonna do that, but um, it would be quite fitting. Uh, no. We'll leave that it as is. Um, so. Path removal time. Now we're gonna get quite a bit of cash uh, back from this. Um, wow, check this out. Alright, that was it. Imagine if you had to do this all by hand. I really like this method of removing path. Alright, and back. 
Uh, this is gonna net us in quite a bit of money. Oh, that's actually pretty neat. If you remove it, we still get like... Oh, <laughs> I was about to say, like, we still get walled cantilevers, but uh, no, <laughs> we do not. Balls. Uh, I don't know whether or not I'll leave the walls up there. It does look kind of nifty. I mean, the majority of them remains in cantilever style. Alright. <laughs> Maybe not. But look at this, man. We got like two and a half grand. Alright. Come on, remove faster. If only those real life tarmac workers could remove tarmac that fast, there would be no traffic jams due to road construction anymore. Um, so, if we remove this... Well, thanks, Daph. I mean, this is all free money. I like free money. I never can get enough of it. Look at that. That's three and a half grants already. Damn. <laughs> Alright. That's pretty cool. Pretty neat. And more. Alright. Uh, I mean, this is just easy to just click. Same for this. You know what, I'll remove this too because I want to have like free space over here and I can always add these in later but I want to use every tile over here to the max, you know. It needs to be crammed with awesome stuff. I mean it's a freaking castle. Come on, be gone. Barrels. You're three bucks. I want it. <laughs> I want it all back. <laughs> Alright, yeah, well, that's exactly what I thought. There's still like path around there. Um, Alright, I think that this is... Yeah, look at that. Now... Oh. Alright, be gone, all of it. Um, is there still more? It's a bit difficult, but... I think we got all of it removed? No, not should be all gone now though, so alright, well then, let's uh, first uh, section done, let's uh, oh, no maybe not, there's like this massive thing, oh it's actually like from the gates leading upwards, <laughs> anyway, um, yeah alright, so time to hire some staff because obviously we don't have any however let's give them some medieval coloring you know because I think that handyman were just like you know farmers and stuff and they would always wear like rags of uh, you know raw cotton and uh, leather and stuff so I think that um, brown is a pretty appropriate color for them all right you know, we gotta do some role play here in uh, Roller Coaster Tycoon. <laughs> I guess that's the first <laughs> role play in Roller Coaster Tycoon. <laughs> but um, yeah, we're gonna do it nonetheless. Let's get some mechanics for the <laughs> crazy amount of rides that we have. Some security guards to protect our transparent interior that we do not have yet. And uh, oh, Roman costume. Well, I mean, that's an easy. So, uh, choice, seeing how we're all medieval and all, and um, yeah, let's get some interior because that's what's important to a park. Ah, oh, well, they shouldn't complain because everything is free. I mean, they haven't paid anything. <laughs> Basically, they're just making a walk, <laughs> and that's it. Oh well, I don't mind that. Um, then let's get some facilities down. It's really important. You know, if it starts raining, they at least can buy umbrellas. Cheap umbrellas. Um, ten bucks. Come on. I wish I could, like, type it in here, but... I know that's not possible. Um, do I want... No. I want black umbrellas, you know? Like, uh, I don't know. Just black. Seems appropriate, you know? Good medieval color. Then we'll get a balloon stall in case they want a souvenir from this super awesome park <laughs> with uh, lots of rides in it. And we'll make them grey. Alright. Then we'll get like two toilets. You know, if they need to puke from the many rides. Uh, 20 cents is enough. I mean, you can't charge like 50 cents for a toilet, unlike they do in the at the gas stations, you know. But... Over here, they won't accept it. They won't pay it. 
Um, yeah, we'll put it over here. Good. And then, let's get like two of these. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, or oh, one drink stall and a fry stall, and that should be it really. Then it's time to uh, start building some actual rides, you know, get some stuff to entertain our guests. <laughs> it might help. Um, Alright, so, well, I don't mind this path, but for the inside of the castle, we are going to use a different path. So, and with that decided, what are we going to use? I think I'm going to go with this. You know, it's just like, well, I don't know, what is it? Like Stones, I guess, you know, natural stone. Yeah, I guess. Because, I mean, I think the square tiles, I think that would be a bit weird. Alright, so we need to go up here. Yes. Now then, what I'm going to do probably is, um, you know, have like a T here at first. And then we'll see whether or not we'll follow along to the sides. But this is for now what we will go with for the start. Yeah. Alright, good. Let's get some interior down. Uh, hey, wait. I think I also kind of forgot trash cans. <laughs> Minor thing, really, but... Uh, <laughs> hmm, I might need them, so let's add those two, right? Alright, and over there, good. Then, our first ride. Now, uh, the visibility over here is a bit bad, but... <coughs> excuse me. Alright, so... Oh, how could it? Yeah, we're gonna go with the tower man in the freaking castle. How cool is that? Um, yeah, we'll put it over here. And like I said, I really want to use the space in this castle to the maximum capability. You know, have a ride on every square inch, pretty much. So I need to be careful with um, the park planning and stuff and such. So that over there, um, and then our very first queue. Now are we going to go with, yeah actually we're going to go with these wooden supports. Because it's medieval like, and stuff. Alright, um, so, we'll quickly set this up, so I guess at least have something to, whoa, <laughs> no, <laughs> not at 90, but 78. 10 minutes, and uh, we're going to charge 6 bucks. Yeah, I mean, we need to make back on the investment. Well, actually, we're still on the money from our infrastructure. So that's good. Alright, then, let's color this a bit wood-like, you know? With, um... Yeah, grey underground. And then a bit of gold. No, 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 no. We'll make this wood as well. And then we'll make this gold and white. No, I like the red better actually. Alright, being the size as ever. So, we're gonna call this, you know, pulling the banner. You know, with a bit of imagination, banner, stuff, things, you know. Alright, so, first ride's there. And immediately, we are luring in guests. Now we got a thrill ride, so we should also get a gentle ride. You know, balance and things and stuff. Um, actually, I'm really, really tempted to have this be built over here and then... Yeah, or not. Oh man, <laughs> decisions! You see, there's already two tiles of unused things if I build it like this. However, I do think uh, you know what? Instead, I know what we will do. I know it already. We will build this because it's in a castle <laughs> and you have no view. <laughs> no, let's not do that. Um, you know what? In fact, we will build the slide. Yeah, slide's perfect for this purpose, really. Um, so, if we build the slide over here. Yeah, I know what I'll do with this. All right. It's decided. Um, let's see here. Oh and the visibility is quite poor, though. I must admit that. 
And yes, and this is how we will do it. Five dudes, of course. Um, ten minutes, alright. Five bucks as well. Come on, five bucks. Yes, I like that. And then, a queue line. Which we will build all the way over here. Uh, balls. <laughs> Alright, so I guess that we're going to end up with one square of unused things. But we'll put scenery down there. Now, you might be wondering, like, uh, damage, how about the exit path? I know, I saw that we had a small issue over there. But, look, exit issue taken care of, more or less. Now, over here, this is uh, on purpose over here, this space here, because I'm going to fill it up with Q and stuff from things that I have planned. Yeah, I'm really being really specific over here, am I? Uh, so, alright, that's that covered. Now, I know that we are kind of like forgetting a minor thing, and that is handy dudes over here. Don't worry, I got it covered. Um, yes, this can be open. And well, all we need to do really is name and call it this. So, if this were to be medieval, it would probably be grey and black. Yeah, what would it be if it were medieval? Um, yeah, well, you know what? We're just gonna call this the... Yeah, the, the chapel... Chapel Leon. Bit of Italian. No, 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 no. Let's not do Italian. Now let's, ca let's call this the Holy Chapel. Chapel. I don't even know whether or not <laughs> it's something, but uh, you know what I mean? Those small praying things from Christianity and things and stuff. Yeah, well, you get the idea. So, a handy dude for uh, this castle. Yes. Yeah. Wow, man, I'm so digging this whole castle thing here. Yeah, I think it's really awesome. Alright, so then let's build another gentle ride, and then it's time for our very first coaster. Now, this over here is going to be truly cool and awesome because um, this is going to be, you know, incorporating things in the wall. I am kind of curious though, it, but it seems that the wall is actually three tiles thick. That's pretty neat. Um, yeah, I like that. Alright, so station platform over there, yes. Now all I need to do is remove this. Ooh, and we got a river ride. Alright. That's pretty cool. Ah, oh, that's actually the upgraded lock view. Alright, so that's definitely gonna be built too. Look, this is what I had in mind with this ride. I know it's only underground now, but... Oh, derp. Maybe I should lower it. Alright, maybe I should terraform the land over here. Nothing major, really. I mean, nobody will notice. And we're the tidiest park in the country. <laughs> no kidding, <laughs> because we barely have guests and rides in our park. <laughs> well, how cool is this, you know? A track covering the entrance. I think it's pretty neat. So... And then, you know what, let's have one of those curves in here. Uh, you, I guess you can kind of figure out now what I'm gonna do with this track, but yep. For well, this car ride, it's gonna be like this. Um, are we in... Yeah, this is the track piece going into the tower. Now, right now we are really hugging the edge over here and, wait, are we coming outside of it? No, we're not. This is all inside, right? I surely do hope it for the car ride. Not, there's gonna be punishment and bad things. I don't know what the ratings will be on this really, because I never really built a truly underground car ride. Well, it's not truly underground, but... Actually, I mean, looking at the colouring, really. 
I think it looks pretty slick, you know? It looks like some kind of ribbon, really. Mm, Alright, let's see. I hope that this is enough. I mean, I so want to keep this cast on oh, nice. You know, keep it intact and stuff. And I think if we just... Yeah, look, it looks incorporated and cool. Oh, man. Castles, man, I'm digging this. Now, obviously, we're going to go with a vintage car. I mean, there's no real choice here. And I'm also going to put this to five bucks and <laughs> hope it's, like, <laughs> you know, good rated and not, like, 0 0.5 or anything. <laughs> I mean, that would really suck. Um, all right, cool. So, let's open it up and uh, get complaints that they cannot reach it. Oh, we're actually not getting them. I don't know, I'm not liking that in the slightest. You know, usually guests do complain about good rides not being reachable and stuff. Alright, so now we shouldn't make this too long. But it's probably what is gonna happen. <laughs> um, come on, yeah it's good. Alright, I don't need to hook this back up. Alright, and this one piece here, we can just put scenery there, you know, that's no problem. Look, space usage, efficiency. I'm not doing all of it. Oh, and, ooh, you know what, I got like another idea as well. Now we're charging enough. Um, let's see here. You know what, let's go with a bit of, um... Now this looks medieval. Well, <laughs> I mean, I'm just making that up. <laughs> Doesn't look medieval at all, really. But uh, you know, it has some medieval-esque theme. Now we need black because you know, realistic colors and things. Um, how does it look like this? I think it looks pretty slick, actually. Some royal ribbon, you know, around. Uh, Oh man, <laughs> no. <laughs> Come on, we're doing it all for the looks, game. Don't screw it up now. <laughs> anyway, um. Yeah, let's call this. Um. You know. The. Race. Through the wall. No, let's not call that. No, let's call this, like, um the guard thing wall no. we need a cool medieval name for something that runs across a wall let's call this like first defense doesn't really make any sense but oh well we're gonna run with it I mean I'm not gonna waste like half an hour on just naming uh, but I do know that we're yeah, gonna go with the uh, log cabin style over here too. In fact, you know what? Let's for inside the castle. Let's use these because we're in a castle, right? It needs to be you know, royal and um, wealthy, and outside it can be all of like shabby logs and stuff. Inside, we're gonna use this spiffy marble. So now that we have that. Um, I say it's time for our very first coaster. Next time when we play more Roller Coaster Tycoon.